Uh, joining us on the phone is Nick Carter from the Backstreet Boys. They're getting together August 15th and 16th. They're in the New York, New Jersey area. Uh, Nick, just speaking of Michael Jackson a second ago, no surprise that, that Michael's on top. But you are friends with Michael. Didn't you and your brother go to his 45th birthday at Neverland and get into a cake fight? Yeah, yeah. I've, um, I've hung out with him on a couple of occasions. But my brother knew him a little bit better than I did. And, uh, you know, like, he was a great guy. He was really good. He was a really good guy. I think misunderstood. And when I spent time with him and when my brother spent time with him, he was a really... He was a gentleman, and he was a great person. Outstanding. The beautiful, and you've dated some very beautiful, gorgeous women. That's part of the, uh, that's part of the, <laughs> part of the success. Do you, one of them was Paris Hilton. Do you ever miss her? Do you ever say, why did I let that one get away? Nah, not at all. You know, <laughs> I uh, moved on from that, and, you know, moved on to uh, heavy things. All right, Nick Carter's on the phone for the Backstreet Boys. And coming up, we're going to talk about uh, cardiomyopathy. What a disease that has killed several different celebrities. But Nick has got it under control. He's lost 57 pounds. He's kicked drugs and booze. Fascinating, kind of inspiring stuff. An amazing turnaround for Nick Carter. Up next on the new Movin' 97.5. Hey, it's Billy Bush continuing now with Nick Carter from the Backstreet Boys on the phone. Just completed their seventh studio album. It's called This Is Us, and it's out October 6th. Nick, a little older now, so are the other guys. Recently, you've dropped 57 pounds. You're in the best shape of your life because you're battling cardiomyopathy. What is that? Cardiomyopathy actually is a, um, it's a disease. It's not, there's not a lot known about it, and they call it the sudden death syndrome. So basically, your heart could just stop. And what it means is that part of your, the walls of your heart have basically deteriorated and died a little bit. Uh, due to, you know, sometimes it's just birth defects, sometimes it's alcohol abuse, sometimes it's drugs. There's, there's a lot of factors involved, but they don't know a lot about it. But um, it causes, like, the walls of your heart muscles to weaken and then um, for it not to function properly. So, For people out there who, who might suffer from something like that, yeah. how, how would you describe the journey? Has it been extremely difficult? Well, the journey... You know, there's been lots of highs and lots of lows. You know, there it's exciting. The journey is totally exciting to as a human being. You know, if you do the right things in your life and you you do the work on your mind and your body and your soul, you know, you can bounce back from virtually anything. Anything is possible. That's how I feel. Nick Carter, man, outstanding, in, in great shape. The music sounds really good. Just psyched to uh, psyched to talk to you. Give my best to the guys, okay? Yeah, no problem. Thanks, brother. 